Welcome to Turbo Dishman! Why am I playing this? Because there are no new games out and I feel like laughing at some silly shit. <laughs> Jesus. There's gonna be a hell of a lot more Gavin free with that pose. Let's, uh, let's just go with that, shall we? I have no- oh, yep, yeah, that's- oh. <laughs> Great. You utter failure. You had one job and you couldn't even manage that. Let's- Let's try something other than the goddamn supposed boss throne. And the only thing that was thrown there was Gavin out of his seat. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna end well. I think the slow-mo guy's gonna be anything but slow with this one. If I can actually nail this, I think... Oh, he's fallen off. You su you're not supposed to be Gavin free until you get to the end of the ramp. There we go. We're gonna... Really, the flappy bird failed that soon? Are you taking the piss? Is the bird gonna catch? No, he's gonna fall down into the landmines, it seems. Now get- Has he been- He's been launched out of- Oh dear. He- You just missed that and you- What? Never mind, your vehicle nailed it. Jesus. You got off scot-free there. Your car isn't stopping, is it? Oh, that's a grand idea. Just stick your ass out the back of a moving hearse. What's the worst that could possibly happen? The police could be coming after us. Okay, and he's fallen off and he just got absolutely annihilated by the police. His head and arm came off. He's officially a new hybrid of Thing. We're going to get Gavin free to try and escape the police <laughs> on a computer chair. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, I don't know, the police immediately knock him over? Jesus. Alright, if you need to outrun the police, get a speedy bike. That ought to do it, right? Surely, there's no way they can catch you. There's... Jesus Christ! There's no way they can catch you as he goes face first into the bloody first thing he finds! I mean, look what he's aiming for, for Christ's sake. He had his eye on the prize. You could see when it came to his attempted escape, he had a little bit of... <laughs> Tunnel vision. <laughs> oh, God. Which he's not going to have very much of anymore as his head detached from the rest of him. Look at this absolute idiot. He tries to make a turn and he throws himself off of the bike. This is, this is not the way you do it. I wonder what bloody happened. One moment he's on the back of his bike, the next thing he's curling himself around the front of it. I think the problem with this... Is the fact that it keeps like bobbing back on the wheel so you don't have any major control of it for the most part, and then next thing you. <laughs> he just went sailing off for crying out loud, man! Get your shit together! Yeah! Okay. Second. Actually, you know, let's try first person trying to control this nonsense. Jeez, I feel sick already. Let's never do that again. Here we go. Full speed ahead. Let's pray that we're not dead. Let's turn it nicely, not screw it up! And maybe not crash into the parked car. Okay, we're gonna flappy bird our way out of this. We can't control the god. We can't control anything else. Oh, Jesus! Police brutality! Look at this guy! He had malicious intent! He comes in to kill! He isn't trying to arrest someone! He's a goddamn bounty hunter! Look at him! He's <laughs> that face just sailing toward me! And then separating from the neck! Jesus Christ! Oh, what am I doing with my life? There we- Oh, there's an ejector seat, apparently! <laughs> I need to ask where the hell he just went. Now let's slow this down a bit, because as soon as this comes off of the ramp, it just ejects. Look, the entire front of it just comes off, and there he goes. How did that happen? What did I do to cause that? You know what? Screw it. Let's keep it simple. Let's just escape through the goddamn tunnel. There was a mine in there, wasn't there? Seriously, it's called the Shuriken, not the Shuriken! Stop falling off this damn thing! Fine, you know what? I'll control the goddamn steering. I'll control it! Nice and slow, nice and- There we- No- Oh, what? I broke it! Oh my god, I broke a hell of a lot more with the wall! Here we go- What? I made the girder spin out! I made the girder spin- Oh, there he goes. Oh. I think ski ball's about to be turned into free ball. Have at it, my man! Please! Bloody nailed it. <laughs> Gavin, I hope you kissed me goodbye, fella. Jeez. And he's been ejected again. See you later, Gavin. He's just gone. Look at him. Oh, this is not going to end well. <laughs> he was locked in 
inside the cockpit of the car and landed upside down with a frown on a landmine. Okay, Gavin, this is all on you, my boy. Don't. He just decapitated himself. Okay. <laughs> he crashed into the back of a bus and decapitated himself. I'm gonna have to see that one again. We're gonna need to see this in the slowest of mo. I mean, he, he just folds in on himself. It's just, oh my god, he doesn't decapitate himself. He just bends his head that far back that it snaps off. I know that's technically the same thing, but I thought he got his bloody neck severed from the bumper. How wrong I was. <laughs> The sliding face. The time is up, my time is now, now. You can't see me, my time is now, now. Okay. You see, this time, it's gonna be much better. By that I mean I'm going to make him completely disappear. Where did he even go? Okay. Let's slow this one down so I can actually see what the hell happens to him. He gets obliterated by a, just an average family car with a bulldozer on the front of it. Where the hell did his face go? Okay, I'm gonna pay attention to this shit. Where does his face go? There it is, there's his face. Found it, it ends up getting trapped in the car. <laughs> oh my, he got decapitated by that shit. It, that is, that is just the worst. <laughs> that really is. Okay, now what if, no, 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 oh, oh, oh. What the hell happened? What the hell happened? Okay, this one's the manual driving challenge. Kind of speaks for itself, really, doesn't it? The oh, I've got to avoid mines and shit. Pretty easy, seeing as I've got to do is stay in the middle. Oh, never mind. What the? <laughs> the thing that defined my score was my death. And the thing that defined my death was my score. Now, all you've got to do, Gavin Freebird, is not hit those mines you're getting horribly close to. You have no idea how hard this is to control. I just broke my arm off. Okay. I'm honestly considering not using the bike, seeing as this is goddamn impossible to control. He's still on it. His, his head was still on it. Now it isn't. Okay. Are we judging the vehicle or judging the corpse? You see, if I go really slow, this actually benefits me greatly. Because then I don't just go face first into everything. Speed isn't key. This is just a case of the tortoise and the hare. You gotta take it slow. Slow and steady wins the race war. Fuck's sake. Now we're gonna hit the booster and slightly shit ourselves. Nice and steady. Nice and steady! Careful, careful. There you go, we did it! Oh, it took bloody long enough. You all know what's coming next. I came in like a ready boss. I never hit so hard in love. All I wanted was some ready to was. All you ever did was ready to that was the most obvious joke to make since two guys walked into a bar and said ow. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'll be ending the episode. Please remember that your continued enthusiasm and support is what keeps this series alive and well. So remember to broadcast that to me in every single way imaginable. And real quick, I'm gonna have to recommend you go and watch the Metagamers content because it is fantastic. He's still my favorite content creator at this point. It's been months since I featured him originally and he's still my favorite. That should say something. His content is that consistently amazing and he never lets me goddamn down that I'm consistently still looking forward to every single one that he uploads next. I'll say it again, it takes some goddamn comedic skill to make a first person shooter entertaining to watch for a massive audience. And if you like finding games and live streams, then True Talent is the perfect combination for you as that is exactly what he does and he's damn good at it. He's one of the few streamers that I watch that actually makes the good balance of enthusiastic while not being ridiculously loud and annoying like me. And assuming you've already done that, then you may want to check out my previous work which you may have missed because the subbox is a poopy, in which case you may want to follow me on social media to keep up with that. You know, in a form that doesn't break consistently. And maybe, just maybe, you'll want to follow my Twitch channel and alternate channel as there's actually content on that that should be updated relatively regularly. But that aside, I'd like to think that you did indeed enjoy this and do you want to see more of it? And assuming that you do, please do like the video to let me know. And assuming that you did, <laughs> then I think it's safe to say that if a certain sir was to start the act and end up arriving prematurely, then I think this isn't the only thing that you could call a turbo dismount. <gasps> What's say? I made another dick joke. Oh, man. I'm just gonna win the comedic Oscars.